Welcome ladies and gentlemen, I want to appreciate you so much because of your great support. Robert Alai has come out to give us a leakage and I want us to read whatever Robert Alai has posted in his Twitter handle. Then I want us to read whatever Advocate Degwa Njiru has posted in his Twitter handle. Handled. This is whatever Robert Alai you see. Sources within the security structures have revealed to me that the security detail of former President Uhuru Kenyatta has been withdrawn. The security detail was withdrawn yesterday. No reason was given for the withdrawal. That is whatever Robert Alai has come out to report. When you look at whatever Ndengwa Njiru, who is advocate, has come also to uh, say, this is whatever Ndengwa Njiru is saying. Nabi William Ruto, be careful the way you are dealing and handling President Uhuru. Our politics are more emotional based than issue based. In 2027, no one will praise you for the Hustlers Fund. You will be guided by the manner in which you handled one of us. Uhuru is our son. That is whatever we are being told. I want us to look at the reason why at this point of view William Ruto has just decided to withdraw Uhuru Megei Kenyatta's security. And because I don't want to say as if I'm the one or uh, I'm the one that uh, confirmed that the security was withdrawn, but because of the tweet of Robert Alai, Advocate Ndegwa Njiru, who, uh, who is well known when it comes to the politics of Azimio, we have been told that at this point of view, after Uhuru Mwigai Kenyatta and with his team came out to visit late Magoha's home at Lovington, during, of course, the condolences period of, uh, of course, the message that, uh, of course, at that time, Uhuru Kenyatta decided that he was going to visit the home of late Magoha. We've seen a lot of issues that this government are not comfortable with. The reason why there, there is a possibility of Uhuru Megei Kenyatta's security being withdrawn, it is after there was also allegation that Uhuru Kenyatta was not paying a tax. This comes after the family of Moi, the security that Uhuru Kenyatta had delivered to them, was withdrawn last year. So the family of Moi is no longer having uh, government securities. I want to say this. When you look at the way William Ruto is behaving, I want to give you an example. There are certain countries that when a retired president is out of the office, in fact, he is being catered for everything. When it comes to security, when it comes to traveling, and all those kind of things, etc. But the truth is, one and only Mr. William Ruto, who is the president of the Republic of Kenya, whom we believe that are not having a good relationship with the former boss, Uhuru Megei Kenyatta, political re relationship, is not well after Uhuru Kenyatta yesterday came out uh, during his speech at Late Magoha Song at Lovington, saying that kuna watu wanaungia mingi lakini kufanya ni bala, but kuna watu wanaungia kidogo lakini wanatenda. So William Ruto is feeling light, like Uhuru Kenyatta is still, uh, of course, throwing heavy words to him. Number two is that William Ruto is so, yani hako na wivu. Let me say wivu. Kwamba, why is it that at this time that he was expecting that after Uhuru's retirement, everyone was going to scatter to his own way? But after Uhuru Kenyatta gathered all this, his former, uh, his cabinet that he worked with, 
people like Matiani, people like Ibicho, people like Peter Munya, they were there. And I want to tell you, I want to tell you, don't come and tell us that the politics of William Ruto is comfortable in Mount Kenya region. You cannot continue fighting their son. Then, in the next election, you will go there campaigning. Remember the ill thing that you're doing to the president, Uhuru Kenyatta. Remember Uhuru Kenyatta is the son of Kikuyu, Gema Nation. Even if today Uhuru Kenyatta was painted as a bad person, he remains a Kikuyu. And a Kikuyu will not accept that his, their people or their son is being vandalized the way it is now. Mtoto ni mtoto yao. Even if he is a thief, even if he was not paying taxes, he is their son. Even if you made it, at a point even you paint bad picture for Uru Kenyatta, even people leaving Uru Kenyatta direction and supporting William Ruto's direction, then William Ruto should not come out just comfortable like that and see that now I'm controlling purely in Mount Kenya region politics. If you could have noticed whatever happened at late Magoha's home, at that time where Uru Kenyatta was visiting, these people who are campaigning together with him when it comes to Azimio politics, they are still intact. Uru Kenyatta, Matiang is there, Peter Munya is there, Kibicho is there, several people are still intact. And I want to say this, William Ruto might see it like is doing a good thing so that people can see that he's working. He is not working by oppressing the former head of state, Uhuru Kenyatta. The way he is treating Uhuru Kenyatta, when that time of him retiring from politics as a president of the Republic of Kenya, could have liked that the next administration to treat him. Because the way he is treating the, the former head of state is not legible. It is not of course, good totally. Because you cannot continue hitting the head of state day in, day out. And the way this, the, 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 the revelation is coming out, I want to say, Aina haja kutoa security, or even kubadilisha security. There's no purpose of William Ruto changing the security of Uhuru Kenyatta and giving him maybe an AP or maybe private, we don't know. But the truth is, according to the report that we are getting, is that the security of Uhuru Megei Kenyatta has been withdrawn, maybe because of revenge too, maybe because they want to show themselves that there is no need to offer a security to former head of state. And literally, when you look at even many scenarios, is that this man is out of revenge. Purely out of revenge. That he want to make sure that those things that he passed through while in the administration, while he was in the administration of Uhuru Kenyatta, he must revenge. Which according to me, this revenge is going to destroy William Ruto. And this character is going to make him being hated by these hustlers. Remember, you cannot choke as well that you're working through withdrawing security of the former head of state. You cannot show Kenyans or hustlers that you're working by hunting the head of state. What to Alipe tax? Yes, but know how you can address that issue. You want to tell me that it is only Uru Mage Kenyatta that was not paying taxes? Let us speak the truth. Let us speak the truth. You want to tell me that it is only Uhuru Kenyatta who was not paying the taxes. Then it means even William Root himself, it reached at a point that he was not paying even taxes, some point of view. Let, let us speak the truth. So these people to come out now, to collide a kikuyu with a kikuyu, that oh, uyu mutu ndi amefanya monaumia, in fact he is colliding Uhuru Kenyatta with kiku, other kikuyus. In fact those who came out raising the issue of Uhuru Kenyatta to pay tax, these were senators from Mount Kenya region. I never saw any senator from Nyanza, Western, Coastal, or Kwambani. So it is high time that Kikuizu must come out to react because 
it is not good that the head of state the former head of state is being done is being of course given this kind of treatment so i think that is my opinion but i want to say the strategy that william ruto is doing and using it is terrible and is going to be messy and messy and in fact is just giving uhuru kenyatta to be popular yes is making uhuru kenyatta to be popular so ladies and gentlemen perhaps that is my opinion what are your opinion drop your opinion at the comment section below otherwise i want to appreciate you so much because of great support please consider subscribing liking commenting and sharing this video otherwise we are having a fundraising to support this channel so that we can buy a camera a strand and a light please if you're willing to support the number the way you're seeing please you can send whatever you have to support this channel otherwise i want to appreciate those who have been uh, they are already sending their donations i want to appreciate you so much it has taken your effort to ensure that you're supporting the work of this channel i will not let you down otherwise thank you so much bye bye till we meet on another video